Welcome to the thrift shop. Today we're going to talk about the iPod Classic. So uh, I've owned uh, the original uh, or this original iPod Classic since uh, since it came out. Um, this is one of the praise versions for its uh, for its Wolfson DAC. Uh, if you look them up, the iPod Classic, you find that uh, this is the, the sought after version. Um, I didn't seek it out when I purchased it. I just wanted an iPod. And luckily I've got uh, one of the good ones. So this was sitting around and I thought, well, it'd be a good idea to rebuild it. So um, the screen was junk. Um, it fell into a, a cup of coffee. The LCD screen was was uh, barely visible. Brown. Um, let's see, the uh, hard drive was going out and uh, the battery didn't have any life, so went on to uh, eBay, ordered uh, a brand new battery, uh, ordered a uh, hard drive replacement, so went to an SD card uh, replacement, and uh, even got a new screen. I think all together, uh, fifty-five to sixty dollars to basically totally rebuild um, this iPod. And I was just curious, how does it sound uh, compared to my? current kind of reference daps so um, started off you had to tear this thing apart um, and tearing it apart uh, I gotta say that I was so delicate with the process um, that uh, being so delicate that I saved myself a lot of time putting it back together uh, if you believe that you're totally wrong uh, because I should have read instructions before I tore this apart and it would have made life a lot easier putting it back together but uh, nonetheless um, I got it back together um, it works it works great now um, I have a 128 gigabyte um, SD card put into here and um, restored it easily around the computer uh, it was up and going in probably about a half hour um, full you know charged ready to go so I did compare it to um, my uh, my DAPs um, and other headphone amps. Um, I think what you find with uh, this old iPod Classic is that it's it's a very warm sound. Um, you don't get layering, texturing. You don't get anything that you get with modern DACs. Um, the Wolfson DAC in here is good, but you're not going to get great sound. Um, it's just very warm, smooth. Um, you cannot drive headphones easily, um, uh, or I should say, let me let me say that again. You can drive headphones, you just can't drive them loud. I don't think there's enough power here, and you start clipping, and uh, the, you get some driver problems. And uh, and certainly planars don't sound good with this. Um, Focal uh, Elysia um, sounds great. Um, just can't turn it up very loud. Um, but other than that. Uh, I've got my full library on here, so uh, I'm not even sure how many songs, uh, but a lot, over a thousand at least, um, on here. Um, good little unit. You know, for 55, 60 bucks, you can rebuild an old iPod and have, uh, have something ready to go all the time. So, uh, nothing wrong with that. Um, definitely, even though I have high definition uh, kind of uh, files on here, um, certainly it's not being reproduced. In high definition but it's a good little good little iPod so well thanks for watching uh, this is a thrift shop if you like it please uh, if you like what you see please subscribe uh, like uh, tell all your buddies and uh, we'll see you back here soon thanks Bye. <laughs>